Here's Lola, the amazing dog's journey. She started down here and escaped about 8 a.m. and just kept going. And it's almost, it looks longer than it is on the image because it's all uphill. Uh, all the way to here. And at this point, this was her last known location. Um, people started looking for her everywhere. Paw prints were discovered over here. A bunch of paw prints of her circling around over here. And apparently also paw prints over here, but this could be any other dog. Uh, so this was her last known location. And so she stayed in this general vicinity for 56 hours from 8 a.m. Thursday until she was spotted right here around 3 p.m. on Saturday. And that guy continued to try to chase her all the way down Knox, all the way to Beekman. And I ended up grabbing her in between Beekman, I mean, in between Knox and Waverly on Beekman at a construction site. So crazy journey. Who the heck knows what she did for two and a half days in negative degree weather and then a couple inches of snow. Uh, she seems completely unfazed uh, by the elements. Her paws weren't cracked. She didn't have a bunch of salt on her. She wasn't dirty. She was only dirty because I tackled her in mud down here. Now where I nabbed her was, there, this is all under construction. This is all mud down here. So I nabbed her right here, uh, pretty much. And this is all, all muddy. But she only was muddy from that. So was she staying in this building? Because this building's open but under massive construction. Who knows? Where did she go? Uh, here's where the house was. Uh, where are we here? Yeah, the house is right here. She stayed somewhere in this vicinity for two and a half days. Was she with somebody? Was she with a homeless person? Did she just find a place to hunker down? I'll, we'll never know, but it's, it's pretty amazing, and we're happy to have her back.